ultrasonic thickness gauge TT100P the content of the box would be the main unit the user manual one 5 mega ohms 10 millimeter dia probe main unit you can get either this or this any one of these there can be chances that the box you get might have this tube but might not have any of the gel inside reason being that if this product is imported by air shipment then liquids are not allowed but to use as a coupling agent you can use a normal vaseline which is very easily available this is the test block just to show it is an optional accessory at an extra cost so we'll explain you about the product the model TT100P ultrasonic thickness gauge the measuring range are 20.7 millimeter is a minimum diameter to maximum diameter of 300 mm or 600 mm we have two uh, ranges in this available with us this particular model what we are showing you is up to 600 mm the uh, it's very important that one needs to look after the contact cable because if it drops the chances of the reading uh, getting a correct reading are then very limited in that case one needs to change the uh, probe for a correct reading this particular model of TT100P uh, can measure speed of sound uh, sorry can measure thickness of any instrument any workpiece for which we know the speed of sound the measuring range of speed of sound is anything between 1000 to 9999 meters per second in velocity the minimum as I mentioned the least count is 0 0.01 so we'll explain you for the main unit two double a 1.5 volt batteries on and off this is the calibrator which is 4 millimeters menu this is for velocity back calibration and enter so we'll explain you menu light on off read data we can read up to 40 readings which can be stored here auto power off 3 minutes unit is millimeters Lang language is english probe size 5 megahertz go back again now we go back here speed of sound for some particular work pieces is fed inside but as it says 0000, zero, zero, zero we can change the speed of sound the way we want so first for for us to calibrate on steel it should be 59 this is the speed of sound of this workpiece is 5920 5920 enter so the speed of sound is is entered here now we can check velocity if you want to fix up again one so the speed of sound is fed here this is how we connect the probe we need the coupling uh, we need the coupling uh, agent so this liquid we will use it
so this will gel it should show a reading of 4 which means it is calibrated now the same way we will try to check these the these are approximate test blocks not the accurate ones but just to have an idea this is 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 like this so for 10 9.98 this is 8.91 so the reading is correct it is very important for you to check that it it you should get this sign which see which means coupled so if we press slightly more the readings can affect that's the reason I'm just giving you an idea that this is how we can check whether it's giving us a right reading or not we will request you once again to take care of the probe especially this part which is a piezoelectric crystal even a small dent on this probe is going to create issues for reading in case you don't get proper readings first thing of troubleshooting would be try replacing the cable this product comes with a calibration report and also a guarantee which is free of cost repaired with parts on the main unit for six months for any other query you can always come back to us or visit our website which is www.portable-testers.com thank you